Hello all, Retro Gamer here coming at you. I'm going to do another part to my Let's Play of Tekken 3. And as I said in the last video, this will be the last part for a little while. Yes, for a little while. As I'm going to start a Let's Play of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone after this. No. Let's look at our theater. Let's find it here. Should show that there's a theater option here, isn't there? Maybe not. I thought there was. That's fine. Now, if I remember right, last time we did it with Xiaoyu and Yoshimitsu. So I think this time we have to do it with. Check this. Let's, let's double check our math here. Okay, no. Yep. Alright. We have to do the law. And I believe lay. Maybe it's just us. Might be. Oh, in any case, let's do it with him. Let's do this. Yes. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. He he he. Round one. Fight the gun away. Oh, hey. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> I love that kid. It's so ridiculous and silly, but it's so fun. y'all don't know this, she's actually based off Jackie Chan. Round one, fight! Oh. 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 Alright. Oh. 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 Try the next one. Oh, your humid too out of the way. All right, shall you? Let's go. Round one. Fight. Oh, that was pretty cool. I can get with that. Yeah. That'll go. Alright. Round two. Fight. Alright. Alright. The punch count was actually pretty effective. They just wanted to care if I played too much, but that was actually pretty effective there. So cool. Alright, law. Well, Round one, fight! Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that was a cool stance. 
it worked out. That's one of the, that's one kind of the cool things about Land. Like I said, I don't play him a lot, but I know he's got a few real cool stances to him. Round one. Round one against Panda. Going in around two. You win. Round two. Fight. All right. Give him the upper cut. Backhand, back to cut. That was cut. Actually, Y'all knew what I meant. <laughs> All right, Gun Jack, let's go. Round one, fight. Oh. Stage seven. Round Gwen. one. Fight. Oh. Oh no. First round. It's not over yet, though. Yeah. Putting up a fight. Um, that was close, but we did it. Alright. Here we go. Dang, the video is at less than nine minutes right now, just under nine minutes. That's a pretty groovy punch combo we had there. Yeah. It's Ash Williams, I'm going to say. Groovy. Alright, here comes Aihachi. Big man. Oh. Possible. Round one. Fight. There we go. Now I'm doing fine. 
Yeah. Uh. Aztec tried to put up a fight. But, uh, I'm an ogre, I'm gonna eat ya. Round two. Fight! I'm <laughs> Got him that high and low, that's what's up. In the final four. Final round. Fight! Alright. Oh. That was uh anticlimactic. Come on, bro, that was your final form. Doubt. Friend feels my guy. <laughs> Badass training montage, that's what that was. Yeah. Yeah, we did that in 11 minutes of the video. I think we can, uh, we could probably afford to go ahead and do another part, or do another character here. Yeah, we can probably do that. Did we miss out on law? We had to have. I think we did anyway. Yeah, we probably did, honestly. If I completely missed out on law. Let's go do let's go play people with law real quick. Round one. Fight. Oh. What's funny is Jackie Chan and Bruce Lee, you can draw some similarities between them, honestly. His law is actually based on Bruce Lee, I'm sure you all knew that. But he's based on Bruce Lee. He almost looks exactly like him in this game. This whole outfit gives me uh fist of duty vibes. And then I'm I might be wrong, but honestly I see Paul Phoenix is kinda like Chuck Norris. Like the Chuck Norris is happening. Alright, we even got a perfect match with her. Cool. That one inch punch? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, got him with that thing and then just go straight into. Hi <laughs> Nice. Seems to the mouth and just went smack him upside the head. Yeah. Round one. Fight. Oh, that's a hyper extension. Oh, that's bad. Uh, 
Huh? Let me get it. Turn the door in. Let's just jump into it. Jump in, burger. Oh, something like that. Now, what if we play through time, New York? Did I just play through time since that way at all? That would be great, uh. That's the sequel, too. A lot of people hated your sequel, man. It got a lot of flack, but. I'm not gonna say it was one of my favorite games of all time, but there was a time that I was absolutely obsessed with it. So, wow, I played a lot of that. I won't put it in my top 10 games of all time, but it's. It's not as bad as people give it credit for. Yes, there are a multitude of glitches and bugs. But, you know what? The soundtrack is on point. Not only that, but the gameplay isn't bad. You know, I like the shooting. I, I love the style. The, the fighting is pretty darn good. You know, especially with all the fighting styles in the game. Yes, it's loaded full of glitches. But the game itself isn't terrible, even with all the glitches. Round one, fight. Oh. Yeah, I played it on, uh, I think, original Xbox, and then I played it on PS2 years later. I still have it on PS2. I had that one and LA. No one talks about this game anymore, though. It makes me really sad. No, they were that hot commodity for a little while. At least LA was, but New York was for a little bit, and then, you know, all the glitches started. <laughs> What's crazy is I remember from when I was a kid, I swear there was a version that I had that I never watched glitch. Not once when I played through it. But I played it again years later, and it did so much that I would legitimately have to restart certain sections over again. I still enjoyed the playthrough, but there were a lot of real bad parts to it that you just couldn't do. You could do them. You just have to start the game over again a few times. Yeah. Oh, man. One minute. Aw, yeah. Oh! You could just... Feel how hard Paul hit the ground, man. That looked painful. <laughs> Round one, fight. Right now with the sweet kick. Oh. My guy. Oh man, that hurt. for that power punch I kept using it all and it wasn't working. Nope, it didn't work. I had to just use a little too fast for us. Yeah, took him down. Yes, we did. 
Alright. Alright, Aztec Shrek, let's go. Round one. Fight. That one in front is all time, bro. Oh. Got him. Perfect timing. Went in for the move in, but boom. You win. Law is actually the character I think I played most as a kid. Honestly, I think he was, you know, my main is when I was a little kid in the arcade. I remember playing a lot of Law. Anyone else thinks that True Ogre is a lot easier than, a, you know, Ogre? I know he's supposed to be this all-powerful final boss, but he's just not in comparison. That was, uh, I think that was everybody. I think everyone's got a little bit of play on them. Yep, I think that was. Yep, because we just unlocked theater mode. Okay. Very cool. Very cool. All right. All right. Um, you know what? We're going to do one more playthrough. Now that we have everyone on the map. And we're gonna play it with... Brian. The OG... He's not the OG kickboxer. But... They didn't have Bruce in this game, so they made him the kickboxer. Round one. <laughs> and I'm okay with that. He's got that usual back elbow that all Tekken kickboxers have. I don't think there's a kickboxer in Tekken that doesn't have that. Round two, fight. Got that combo too. Got them power kicks. Yep. There you go. That's got some good knockbacks to it. I like that. I feel like that's something that they slowly sort of got rid of though with Brian over time. It's his knockback power. I don't know. I, I guess I just don't like violent Brian. That's my thing. I'll go through Brian just a little bit better. There we go. Down to that time bar. Nice. <laughs> you win. 
Man, Brian was so much cooler back then. For Henning style. Although Brian is pretty cool now, he's an absolute psycho. <laughs> kind of love it. Fits his character. I think some of his moves kind of say that he's a cyborg just the way the sound effects work on some of his moves. Like that. Hey, I'm wrong. I don't know. Kind of sounds like that to me. Kind of like a kind of like cybernetic parts. It's like he's part robot. Because he is. At least in the second movie, I don't know. Well, no, he is. Yeah, it's a big old plot point back and forth, isn't it? Round Aren't I silly? <laughs> yeah, because, um, in his ending, Yochimitsu saved him. He would, uh, go to a grip. He would, uh, go to a grip, uh, He doesn't die because, uh, well, Brian went ahead and massacred the Manji clan. Sorry if that was a spoiler, but that guy's been out. I'm sure that explained it by now. Seven right now, we're nearing the end. Oh, missed my kick. Sorry, she blocked. Got her back. Back over. Stage eight, King. Oh boy. <laughs> Round one. Fight. Look at the suplex one. Oh, that's that one. There we go. Suplex. Woo. Is that easy, Tiki? Oh, uh, Kitty. Let's go for a DDT in round two. Round two. Fight. There we go. Oh. Needs to win the fight. All right. Got high hockey next. Yeah, it's kind of more like a brain buster now that I really think about it. It's like a combination of the DDT and a brain buster. <laughs> Combo. Nice. Oh, all right. That's round one. Round two. Fight. All right. The only way that would have been better is if he had gotten the perfect 
Either way, we wrecked that boy. Yes. Absolutely. All right, round order. one. Fight. Oh. Now one of them is relatively easy. Alright, let's go round two through over. Round two. Fight. Yeah, that combo is sweet. Dang. Screw it, let's get again. That's gotta hurt. Where you got that signature laugh. Yeah. Nice. I love it. That's the start of that signature laugh that he has. I love it. Absolutely. Alright, y'all. This is a retro gamer with, um,. With this part piece let's play here, I decided to do uh, three characters for you since I won't be back for a little while yet uh, to this game anyway. Anyway. Just because I want to film part one of uh, Harry Potter and the Philosophy Stone on the PlayStation 1 for the Channel 2 and then come back to this. And then we'll do the other unlockable characters. And possibly Tech and Force, I'm not totally sure yet. I do want to do Tech and Force eventually, but it might be a little bit. I gotta practice on it, because I am terrible. <laughs> so in the meantime, uh, you guys have a great day whenever you see this video. And... Thank you for watching.